Hi, I'm Danielle Burkett, reporting in front of Murray Library, just one of the many places that students can come to study for finals. Um, the easiest way for me has always been to approach finals like I approach every other test, um, to prepare the best I can and try not to psych myself out for it. Um, the library is really helpful because I hate having noise around me while I'm studying. So the library is a really, really helpful place for me. Studying for finals is usually a bit of an ordeal. Um, I'm a biology major, so we always have some lot, lots and lots of notes to go over for our finals. Um, I usually spend quite a long time looking over my notes. I usually do practice problems for chemistry in the book. Um, if it's not one of my more difficult finals, sometimes I don't do anything, um, but that has never hurt me too badly in the past. The oh. majors, we have juries that like uh, your major final. So if I, I'm cello major and I have to play a concert in the end. Um, so I just practice, I have to practice all the time. That's, uh, um, also, I have the regular finals, like for my genetic classes and it's, I just study for them. <laughs> no matter how you prep or plan, finals are unavoidable, and unfortunately they begin on May 9th, so good luck.